Okay, so I'm Polly and I run a business called The Talent Stack. Um, we do the people part of growth, which basically means that we help people hire well, manage well and lead well whilst they scale. I think for me, this uh, room is going to be full of people who are definitely coming from really high performing cultures themselves, but uh, it is about this, these differentiators. It's about what they might want to consider if they're going to reset the business and try to do something slightly different. I think the founder team in every instance is the most critically important to get right and the most pervasive and the most impactful on results and the commercial success of the business. So um, critically important to me would be identifying in a spin out um, that you have got those capabilities um, at, the, at the very senior level uh, to the, that are going to deliver results and, and scale quickly. One of the things that we found is that a lot of these cultures have a really strong focus on fight or dissent or challenge or um, a grit, they call it, um, and those are factors that you don't commonly see embraced in a big corporate culture. So thinking about how they do things like that, um, things like that are obviously achieved by having a real, really strong focus on feedback is absolutely critical. Um, and then speed is the other massive thing, um, you know, and everyone's talking about, you know, 10x growth, but you're really in a situation where you've got like 1x time to actually deliver um, versus a kind of corporate culture and that is going to make them be able to compete and do something different. The other thing though that's really interesting is we're seeing massive patterns around people looking for security now in terms of employment. So whereas 10 years ago people might have been attracted to the mission of a startup, I think the people in the room tonight have got an inhu a, a really strong pull for great talent because they might offer more security. No, I don't think I would because I think it's I think that a beta business is about taking the appropriate elements from a startup and thinking about how those translate into a, a, a spin out of a bigger business. So if you're wanting to go fast and innovate, then, then those, those critical factors are the same. And in fact, you know, I'm working with early stage startups that are taking a much more structured and abilities based uh, approach to their hiring. And those are the ones that are getting the big investment and being taken really seriously. So for me, those two types of businesses are meeting in the middle.